What does VDRL non-reactive mean? The full form of VDRL is Venereal Disease Research Laboratory. The VDRL test is a screening test to detect non-specific antibodies in the blood that may indicate a syphilis infection, a sexually transmitted infection caused by the bacterium Treponema pallidum. The VDRL test involves drawing a blood sample from a vein which is then processed in the lab to separate the serum. This serum is mixed with the reagent to check for the presence of non-treponemal antibodies through flocculation which means clumping. Results are reported as react and non-react. A VDRL reactive result means that the VDRL test has detected the presence of non-treponormal antibodies in the blood sample. This typically suggests an active syphilis infection or a past infection that may still be affecting the body. However, because of non-treponormal tests like the VDRL can occasionally produce false positive due to other conditions like certain autoimmune diseases and other infections, a reactive VDRL test is usually confirmed with a more specific treponormal test such as fluorescent treponormal antibody absorption test to accurately diagnose syphilis. A VDRL non-reactive result means that the Venereal Disease Research Laboratory did not detect any antibodies associated with syphilis in the blood at the time of testing. This typically indicates that the person tested does not have an active syphilis infection, assuming the test was conducted at a time when antibodies would be present if infection were occurring. However, a non-reactive result does not rule out the possibility of very early syphilis or very late stage syphilis infection, where antibodies antibodies may not yet be detectable or may have diminished. Further testing or follow-up may be recommended depending on clinical signs, symptoms and risk factors. Reasons for conducting the test include number 1. Symptomatic diagnosis. To diagnose syphilis in individual presenting symptoms suggestive of the infection such as sores or shankar at the infection site, rashes or other manifestations. Number 2. Screening. As part of routine STI screening, especially for pregnant women, individuals with high-risk sexual behavior or or people living with HIV. Number three, monitoring treatment. To assess the effectiveness of syphilis treatment as the levels of non-treponormal antibodies typically decrease with successful treatment. VDRL is a non-treponormal test that detects antibodies that are not specifically directed against the syphilis causing bacterium but rather against components released from the damaged cells during an infection. These antibodies can be a response to other conditions as well which means non-treponormal tests are not specific to syphilis. The primary use of non-treponormal tests is for screening and monitoring the effectiveness of treatment for syphilis. Common non-treponormal tests include rapid plasma reagent, measures antibodies that react with cardiolipin, a substance found in the cell membrane. Venereal disease research laboratory test, VDRL test, usually detect non-specific antibodies in the blood that may indicate a syphilis infection. For more detailed information, visit our website erastoworldhealth.com. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.